The GBI is on the scene of a deadly deputy shooting in Forsyth County, and Good Day's Mark Teichner is live and coming with the latest. Mark? Well, good morning, Buck. Uh, they have just removed the body of the domestic violence suspect that was shot as a result of all of this. This taking place here on Carbone Court. Uh, we're in the southwestern part of Forsyth Cum, uh, County. According to investigators, uh, they got a 911 hang-up call uh, from the home you see in front of you at about uh, 10 o'clock last night. Dispatchers called back to the house and a woman answered. She told them that she was involved in some kind of domestic dispute with her husband. As a result of that, uh, the sheriff's office sent a total of three different deputies to this scene. They ended up arriving at the house. The woman answered the door. She let them in and then she took them towards the kitchen area and that's when the shooting took place. As the deputies were talking to the female, a male, which turned out to be this female's husband, appeared uh, displaying a gun. At this moment, one of our deputies took defensive action and shot and killed the husband. No other shots fired the deputies as well as the woman not injured as a result of all of this. At this point, the GBI has taken over the investigation. The deputy who fired that deadly shot has been placed on routine paid administrative leave. No family members besides the two, husband and wife, were inside the house when all of this began. We're going to have an awful lot more on this story coming up at 6 o'clock, so make sure you tune in for that. But for now, that's the latest from Forsyth County. I'm Mark Teichner for Good Day Atlanta. All right, Mark, thank you.